Hiya, my name's The Gaffer and welcome back to another video. Now, if you've seen the previous episode, which I hope you have, I hope you've given it a like as well, you will have seen that we was unsure whether we were going to make it to the next episode. But what we got out of those packs, a few bits of sold, we're in a little bit of a profit. We've got 18,000, we only need 15, we're in the money. So. The next episode is about to start, and so if you like Draft to Glory and you like me saying and so loads of times over the course of one sentence, then give the video a like and I hope that you subscribe and you come back for more as well. So without further ado, let's get into this draft. 15 coins straight in there. What formation are we gonna get? 433 holding, 3412, 343 flat, 4411 or a 4-3-2-1. We had 4-3-2-1 last time, and it was an absolute nightmare. I think we do 4-3-3 holding, and then we see what we're gonna get with this one. Straight in there, who's our captain? Captain Fantastic, Haggy, Bale, Mbappe, Cruz, Lukaku. You just gotta go with Mbappe. There's no one better. No one does it better. Maybe Ronaldo, but Mbappe. So what we're looking at, France, so we need some, we need some French Ligue 1, Ligue 1 players. What are we starting off with? Nobody. Nobody really. Bale, at least he's with Tottenham this time. I remember when he popped up last time, he was with Real Madrid. Let's go with the fastest man, Mo Salah. Duh, 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 duh. Ah, Manny Manny. Italy, it's the jump, so there's, there's no French players whatsoever. We'll go with Martinez, the man of many formations. So it's not looking good so far. It's not looking good. Van der Beek, Tolisso, Valverde. Again, nobody here. I think we'll play it safe and we'll go with we'll go with Van der Beek and we'll maybe go with a little bit of a, a Prem feel to it as well. Anybody French? So we do have Decore, he will link with Mbappe and he'll give us a little bit more at least something that's there as well can we get maybe a French Premier League player no French whatsoever but we have got Premier League but we do have Verratti French French Verratti what's he going to do for us we can have a strong one. so he's going to be on seven it leaves those on four you've got to go with a little bit of safety here guaranteed guaranteed safety can we get a French French right back? No, we're going to Spain. Joe Cancelo. Oh, we've got an Italian. No, just Cancelo. I'll go with him, I'll go with him at right back. I'll go with him at right back. So Prem, Prem defence. And as I say that, we don't get anybody to do with the Prem whatsoever. So Portugal or maybe from the Netherlands. No one at all. Go with Langlex. Hope for the best. Give me, give me a Prem, no, I'm, I should stop saying Prem. Zuma, Sergio Ramos, he's gonna link, he's gonna link with Lang, what we're looking at. So Van der Beek's on three, whereas if we get Zuma, at least puts him on six. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that, I'll take that, I'll take that, excellent, excellent choice. It was luck, it was luck, but I'll take that all day. So we got, oh yeah, Mende, slot yourself right in there. So, we're looking at goalkeepers. French Premier League, Loris, Ter Stegen, Courtois. Who's he going to link with? So he's got a strong link there. Ter Stegen. Is Ter Stegen better? No, he's not getting anything for those ones. So yeah, we're looking at Courtois. Courtois on seven. Oh, Ter Stegen. I've used Courtois before. I haven't used Ter Stegen. So I think I'm going to go with, go with Ter Stegen. Hope. We get Maurice Fabianski. Edison. He's not he's gonna be the same thing though, he's not he's not even gonna be green. So what's the point? I'll take him for that. There's nobody else there. Mandanda. He is French, so he, he possibly would get ten, but I don't want Mandanda in that. I simply don't. Edison, is that gonna make a difference? Get an amber link. He's taking him down. Is that a is that it? Yeah. Yeah. So Stegen. He's half in there, lad. Getting between those sticks. Looking for some big saves. 
So what we're looking at, changing that right back. So instead of Walker having Cancelo, maybe Alex Mendy's not changing. He's not getting out of there. So yeah, put Walker in there. See what else we're gonna get. Mina, Semedo, Skrimra. Sounds like a Pokemon. Let's go with Semedo. He's not. He's not starting. He's not starting. I'm gonna be honest. What? What is this? Anybody from Korea, Spain? It's, it's take him. I'll take him. Yeah, Walker isn't doing anything out there. He's making any of it. You know, when you look back, you think maybe I should have just taken Mars Marcelo, and he would have had a little bit of a uh, a little bit of camp for that one. But what's done is done. You can't go back. What's done is done. So we've got, oh, Lozano, oh, he's Italy. So we've got, in the centre midfield, a guy, what is that, French, PSG. Hmm, hmm, struggling, struggling. Because we could take Parter. Take Parter, increase our midfield to make it a little bit more. But guy, he will give a little bit of chem. There'll be a strong link to that one, but then we do lose two links as well, so they go to a seven with they drop down. And Van der Beek is already on six, so I'm quite content with that one. And we're looking at midfielders, swap out Partey, you no know, we need the coroners to go in there. There's a lot of things to think about here, but I'm gonna go with a super sub and I'm gonna go with Azano because he's an absolutely banging player so straight left field, straight left field. What we've got here, right winger, Sereva. Yeah, let's take him up. Bump up that chem. Fantastic. Things you love to see. So we just need a strike French left forward. Nigel de Jong. Where could we could put him in central defensive midfielder? He's the best one that we've got, and he's the only one that makes a little bit of sense. He does bump it up, so he's got a strong one, so he puts them on 10. I don't know. I don't know how it works, but it works. So I'll take that. I'll absolutely take that. All day of the week. Oh, what's this card? A hero card. So we've got Striker Lukaku, Belgium, Belgium. These are all from uh, France. So a French. Put him up top on the left wing as a striker. Or we could get Timo Werner coming off the bench as well. I think. At least with Werner, he might be out of position, but uh -huh. ignore that, ignore that. Maybe it's the wrong choice. I don't know. I just simply don't know. Who else have we got here? Let's go for the top rate one. It doesn't really matter. Mexico, French, German. It doesn't matter. At the end of the day, Rashford. Oh, Payet. He would. He'd definitely do the chem. He'd smash the chem out of the water. But do we say no to Rashford? For the greater good, I'm bringing him in. That might be wrong. Might be the, the stupidest decision I've made all day. Probably not, and it definitely won't be moving forward. But, gotta do what you gotta do. We'll take McTominay. He might stick in, might stick in the field as well. And our final pick, we've got Ol Campos Piate. Let's just take him. Right, so these are player picks that we've got. I'm going to have a little tinker as I always do and see can we make this team a little bit better? Can we increase that chemistry? Maybe take it up to what 91 or more? Well, we'll come back when I've had a little think. Okay, so I've had a little tinker around with the squad and we've got the chemistry up to 97 overall. So based on what's on the substitutes bench here, and then what's on the pitch as well. I think this is probably the best that we're gonna get for this squad here. So as you can see, we've got Mbappe on a 10. I think that's the main bit as well. Defenders, they're both on seven, bare minimum. So we're looking a lot better than we were before. If we can get either a French or a Premier League manager, then we're laughing. We're absolutely laughing. And of course, every time I say, what do we need? We 
to get the complete opposite of that as well. What we're looking at, two Portuguese players or two Spanish ones. Go with Jose, not quite Mourinho, but we'll take it nonetheless. Overall, Team Camish 98, 85 rated, 183 rated squad. With that, let's get into our first draft match and see what team we have awaiting us in the first round. Show me who has come to play. John Stones, Wan Bissaka, Olazano. They've got Ronaldo up front, so always dangerous. And Neymar as well. Quite a nice team. Well, they've got like two, two players that are good. But still, based on current form, we need to be wary. Let's get into it. Oh, he's in gold. Oh, save Langlax. Keeper. Oh, he's back in. Oh, dearie me. Not the best start, but I always said he's going to be dangerous when he's got Cristiano Ronaldo. Just couldn't get ourselves out of the box then. Absolutely jammed in. Still early days, still early days, plenty of time. Payet on the wing and Sarabia on the other, it doesn't help, they've got no pace whatsoever so it does make it a little bit difficult, but it's not impossible, not when you've got Mbappe. Whoa, what's going on there? Harry Winks got absolutely taken out like a train. The core, eh? One. Oh, should have been a goal then. Shame, if it was Mbappe instead of Decore, would have been laughing. Oh, what's going on? Walker. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, don't, don't do this again to me. Not the first round again. Don't need this. I don't need this. Not today. Not today. He went under his shoe. He was good goal. Fair enough. Yeah, we need to get we need to get some pace in these wingers at half time. Payet just isn't doing it. Mbappe is being left on his own. He's being let down by his PSG teammate and that West Ham reject. That is Payet. Substitutions inbound. Starting off second half, we've brought on Martinez and Lozano to just get a bit more pace out on the wings. He's brought on Messi, excellent, excellent. Lozano, get running, son. That was that was his poor decision. Decore is absolutely woeful. Come on, come on, yes, yes. The comeback is on. Donny van der Beek, one to watch. Brilliant assist by Mbappe as well. There we go. That's what we need. Forty minutes, forty minutes to get a second goal. I'll take it to extra time, I don't care. Come on, Walker. Come on, Walker. Goal. Oh, for fuck's sake. The simplest goal that will chip to the top. Nightmare. Here he is, doing some subs. What have we got? What have we got on the bench? Who could we bring on that's going to make a bit of a difference? Mo Salah. Bring him on for... Van der Beek, who scored on Corey. Um, in fact, let's bring him on for McTominay and then we'll put Salah down there as well. The last roll of the dice. You gotta do what you gotta do. Come on. How how have you missed that? How have you missed that shot, man? How, Mendy, you've just run through him. You've just run straight through him, Mendy. Great save. Great save. Oh, what? 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 What have I just seen? He's just gone straight through the whole defence with one pass. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. When you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Why is Van der Beek running, running up to the side there to get it in? Not bothered. 4-2. We, we still need two more goals. Doesn't make a difference. 
Watch Van der Beek though, before that goal, Van der Beek was started running up to the sidelines. And what 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 are you doing? What are you what are you actually doing? Oh look at him, he's got through Neymar now. Renson, what why why oh I'll give him a pen. Give him a pen, he might as well. We might as well. We might as well. This is an absolute disaster. I'm going same place as the last video. We're going to the left. No, we're not. We're going to the right. The keeper's left, our right. As we're watching this, we're going to go to the right. Neymar's got the worst run up ever. But is he a guy that's going to go down the middle? Nah. I'm going to the right. It doesn't matter either way. It doesn't matter. I knew it. I knew it. If only, if only we could perform like that for the rest of this game, we wouldn't be in this mess. Oh, well. That's just mint. That's brilliant. What can you say? What can you do really? That's FIFA. You win some, you lose some. Sometimes you'll get four wins in a draft. Other times you'll get first rounded. That's the luck of the draw. But we've had fun. We've tried Mbappe. We've played with a few players that we wouldn't have normally played with either. We've been absolutely embarrassed by three players, Ronaldo and Neymar. Specifically Ronaldo because he scored three goals. So let's get into the rewards once again for a first round knockout. There we go, confirmation of the first round knockout. What will be our prizes? A silver players pack and then two 5k packs. That silver players pack, honestly, that is the best pack out of all of them that we that we can get. We get a West Brom player, we're absolutely laughing with these ones. Let's see what we're gonna get. We don't need to see the board, it doesn't matter. That is completely irrelevant. Anybody, so we've got a Spain, Spanish one, MLS, a couple of those ones from there, so he might be worth something, we'll check after. We'll check later on. We don't need to see the prices for this video. It's not a trading video. Send them up to the trade pile. Get into the 5k packs. I think the 5k packs anyway. I'm not 100% sure. Are we going to see some, some pack magic? No. It's not even a board. It's not a board. Is it? Oh, at least it's a rare. Right back. Andre Almeida. You know, it could. It could be worse. We could have got nothing at all. Powerhouse, position modifier again, healing, goal song, goal song, Dana, whatever that is. Awful with pronunciations. Last pack, last pack before we end today's video. Is it going to be my worst nightmare? Yes, it is. What have we got? Is it a rare contract? Manchester United TIFO. That might sell for a little bit unfortunately, I'd love to stick it in the bin because United are the worst team in the world. I am a City fan though, so maybe I'm a little bit biased. But, once again, if you've made it this far into the video, thank you for sticking along and watching it. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. See you later.